Morris test is performed with your patient lying supine. You're going to bring the hip into slight flexion, and then your proximal hand will be over the medial and lateral joint line. While you're performing the test, you are feeling for possible clicking or catching or recreation of meniscal symptoms. Uh, for the first pass, you'll start with their knee either externally or, excuse me, their tibia either externally or internally rotated. And then you're going to bring them through a large circle that's all the degrees of knee flexion and extension. You can then rotate the tibia internally and perform that same motion, looking for the elicitation of meniscal symptoms.